Yo, y'all terrorist niggas know that boy who go by the name D's? D's? Yeah, D's nuts. First day of school coming up, right? Yeah, next week. So y'all need, like, school clothes and shit? Yeah. Thanks, man. Damn, 200? Yo, thanks, ma. Oh, you need to thank my man Marlo. He ain't want to see you little motherfuckers going raggy on the first day. Hey, Marlo? Nah, man, no thanks. But you ain't got to do nothing for it. No, thank you, man. What the fuck is wrong with you, boy? You too good for my money? Or is you such a bitch-ass punk you worried about my money come from? No thanks, shorty. We cool. I've been watching you make that bag. You got a natural right hand. I train you myself, personally. Nah, really, I just want to keep doing what I'm doing. Well, this is easy. I know you can do it. You're not giving me a choice. You have detention. Mr. P, you know Michael can't make it to detention. I know he didn't. Now it's doubled. He's got two days to serve. Nah, I mean, he can't. He gotta go pick up his little brother from school. Well, he'll just have to find somebody else to do that. It, it ain't like that. I mean, Michael would come if he could, but wouldn't have nobody else to pick up his little brother Buck. And you know, his mother, she on that stuff. Where's the rice Cerrone? Ma, where's the rice Cerrone? There's this boy in the stoop, looked like he was starving. So you cooked it for him? Nah, I just gave it to him. You just gave it to him? Boy ate a raw box of rice Cerrone. Guy staying close. That's how you take away his power. Yo, dude is cut. Yeah, man. That's discipline. You take care of your body, your body take care of you. All right, now, so you live over on... Hey, hey, my boy, what you doing? I'm gonna take you home. Nah, no thank you. Michael, come on now, serious. Nah, no thank you. I'm good from here. Hearing good things about you. So you straight up, take care of your people. Not begging no handouts. You come up under my wing, youngin', you ain't gonna do nothing but rise, man. I don't even know why you thinking about quit. Look, man, like I already told you, I'm all the way repaid. And tomorrow's school. That we always in the market for a good soldier. You see one we like, we take care of the situation. Take him in, school him, make him family. And if you're with us, you're with us. Just like we be with you all the way. I got a job too. What? Yeah, with Bodie. I'm moving the package. You want to go on it with me? You sure? We can work together. Nah, man, that's your thing. Go do what you do. Hey, you seen Spider around in it? I mean, he ain't been around the gym in like a month, man. I leave messages, he don't call. I don't understand, man. He's one of my best welterweights. Now, why we just quit like that? Why don't you ask his moms? Michael, my daddy came home. Daddy. Look who home. Michael. Damn, you grew. He had 12 years. For Rome. It was only a drug charge. You swore he wasn't coming back. This is a good thing, Michael. It's gonna be back the way it was. The way it was? We're your family again. You lied to me. Fuck. Hey, big man. Get over to me now. We were just going over. Now.
something at home? No. Come on. I said no. Okay. So is there anything you want to talk about? You ever call social services on your mother? What? I don't know. I just want to know what happens if you call social services on somebody. You want to report your mother? She brings someone home. He won't leave. You don't want to call social services. They get to looking into things. They can put you on a group on them. Just put your own bug up you. But I don't want us to leave. I just want him to leave. You're talking about Bug's daddy, ain't you? Maybe you ought to talk to a teacher about this, man. Mr. Presbo is real good about stuff. Mr. P did say I could go talk to the school social worker. Mr. Robinette? He an alcoholic. Oh, um, what about that boxing guy? Mr. Cuddy. What's wrong with Cuddy? I don't know. Like, he just too friendly, you know? That shit creep me out, man. Like, he's some type of faggot or something. Nah, not Cuddy, man. He be all up in women. Yo, don't you see how he be doing? That don't mean shit. Them faggots would be just like that, too. And I don't know, he, he just too friendly, you know? Everybody just too motherfucking friendly. I thought maybe I could catch up with Chris. I got a problem I can't bring to no one else. Look, I told y'all, I just want him gone. Just want him away from me and Buck. All right, I'll take care of the boss. Where you going? I'm gonna go look for him. You ain't gonna find him. Why not? Cause he ain't coming back. And what up with you? It's like lately you going on, like taking off the mask, yo. What up with that? If Walker got a look, he didn't. But what about the thing with you and Randy? Everybody now saying you threw that with him. Busted a boy dimples in it. Yo, you wouldn't have stood tall? It's not what I'm saying. It's not that you do shit. It's how you do it. Yo, look. I'm not trying to stand around and let no chump ass niggas think I'm shook. Go ahead, Nay. Get your pack off this bitch so we could go. I ain't want it. Let me get a word with you, Mike. Listen, you gotta understand, I can't be having no physical confrontation like the one took place back there. That kind of thing got to stay outside my gym. Yeah, go ahead, Montel. I come to tell you I was wrong, the way I handled Step off, nigga. Shit! I'll hang here for the ambo, all right? Go with your people. Go ahead, son. Hmm. How you liking the crib? Fine, thanks. You ready to put in work? You can look at me in the eye now. No matter who he is or what he's done, you look him right in the eye. You don't ever want to be the last man to a party, you feel me? That's why I show up to a job an hour before, sometimes two. Why are we doing June Bug anyway? Heard he called them all little dicks up, talk shit like that. You heard? You ain't sure? People say he said it. You give me a sign, meet me out front. Michael, you go around the alley. Body come busting out the back. You drop that shit. (laughs) 
You want to talk on it? You know, what you're doing so good, though, maybe you throw some ends my way. Seeing as how I was here for you and all. I ain't paying you to be my mother. You told me Duval wasn't coming home before we even know he was dead. You said he's running with them. Running with who? Chris, Snoop, all them gangsters. Who else doing all the killing around here? Your young and Michael. Maybe it was him ran his mouth. He got picked up, right? No, I did that thing for him. Why were we talking about him putting self in? You been tested on the streets. Maybe you act different in rooms downtown. Boy, you been throwing up all kind of back talk about shit. Buck wild about this and that. Like what? Crying about how Junebug and his people got lit up. Crying about how Omar on the street running his mouth. What up, so? I don't know. You tell me. Ain't everybody locked up, right? I mean, damn. Yeah, because of that shit, I'm going to need you for some serious business tomorrow, man. Smart nigga. He always was. How do you know? Y'all taught me. Get there early. Why? What'd I do wrong? Chris locked up behind something he done for you. And you downtown with the police. I ain't say a word. Yeah, that's what you say. But it's how you carry yourself. Always apart. Always asking why. When you should be doing what you told. You was never one of us. You never could be. Shed no tears. Come on, Buck. Do you know who I am? His name is Vincent. Used to be Marlo's bank. But Marlo ain't around no more. And you still moving money for other players. So, I'm thinking some of that money need to be mine. Shit. You just a boy. Mm. That's just your knee. He's just a kid. <laughs> 